welcome back to another video. So today I am going to be reading The Love Hypothesis. I have obviously already read it so the video is like clips throughout the past week that I was reading it. So let's get into the video. And this time it was like, like a full on. I just want them to hurry up and get together now. I can't wait for them to get together. You can tell they like each other. Oh my god, I can't get over it. So I'm on chapter 7, which is 31% through the book. And so far, I'm loving it. The chapters, they are like long chapters to me i say the long chapters they are like 20 pages long each one and i'm only used to like 10 page chapters and it is kind of a slow read until something good happens like i'm not saying that the book is good because it is really good and also i'm sorry that i keep looking outside it's snowy <laughs> but no there's parts it's like a slow read and then when something good or exciting happens it speeds up a little bit and then it goes back to slow and speeds up. Oh, I'm loving it. Hi, so I started reading The Love Hypothesis six days ago, so almost a week ago, and I'm 64% through it. I'm on chapter, well, almost on chapter 15, so I'm more than halfway through it. The lighting is so bad. Um, this is the first book that I've started to annotate. You can see I do only have one um, sticky note, so I'm just using one. But I'm just doing it for like romantic side of things. But so far, I am loving this book. So basically, the main characters are Olive and Adam, which Olive ends up kissing the first boy that she sees, which ends up being Adam. So then her best friend and her ex. It was like a situation ship in a way. Um, could get together because her friend felt bad about liking her ex. And she didn't want to go out with her un unless she knew that she was happy with someone else. So she kissed the first boy that she seen, which was Adam. And they've been seeing each other like every Wednesday to go and get coffee. And the more time they're spending together, the closer they're getting and they're like opening up a lot more they're like flirting laughing at everything making jokes giving each other nicknames 
and it's just so cute and I really can't wait for them to get together because I can just see it coming I know that they're gonna get together and it also does say it in the back I'm just hoping it's soon because Olive has admitted to liking Adam and she won't tell him and he thinks that she likes her ex which is now with her best friend so she's got herself into a sticky situation with that and then Adam, one of Adam's friends said to Olive that he's been having a crush on this girl for years and she was like well no it can't be me it's probably someone else and she started getting like feeling dead um bad for it because she was like he likes another girl he's fake dating me and obviously with all of that she then got herself into another like situation which she's trying to get out of so she asked him if he likes her and he said no and oh my god that really annoyed me because I know that he does I know they like each other and it's annoying me they won't just tell each other so I'm hoping it is very soon that they get together and they tell each other just let it all out because at the moment they're sharing a hotel room together but I know I know it's not going to be yet it's just annoying me because I just want to hurry up <laughs> but I know it's probably going to be closer to the end it's just annoying me like the chapters though the chapters are long well to me they're long but I'm getting through it and I just can't wait to finish it now. Not because I'm getting bored of it, I just want to know. Like, I just wanted to hurry up and get to when they're going out because it's just what I've been looking forward to. So I'm hoping that that hurries up. But the rest of it, I know that this video is more of it like time lapsing. It's just because. I just keep on wanting to finish it so I keep on like forgetting to record so this is my thoughts so far almost well just ha past halfway through but I'm gonna try and read some more of it now person I've started hating this is Tom oh my god if I was Olive he would have been fucking punched I hate him <laughs> together it took me 15 hours to finish this and I finished it in a week which to be honest that's like the amount of time that it usually takes me to finish a book unless I take breaks which which I did take some breaks but not that many I think I took like two days off reading it but it's just because the chapters some of the chapters were like quite big and I'm not the biggest fan of them but I rated this book a five star as I think I said in the video somewhere at first I didn't want the book because I don't like the front cover that much well I didn't at first and I don't know what it is it's just because I don't like people on the front cover I just think it looks kind of cringy I don't know it's just my um, thing on it 
but I bought it because I seen it all over TikTok, Instagram, Pinterest, and everyone was reading it, saying it was really good. So I decided to get it, and I don't regret reading it. Like I love this book; it was such a good book. I, also, the first book that I um, annotated, which there was so many stuff that I was just like, I love this part of it. I love that part of it because obviously the main characters is Adam and Olive. And the banter between them two, I don't know what it is, it was funny but cute at the same time. But the whole way through it, I just wanted them to get together. But I'm not going to give any spoilers. I can't remember what I said as, as I'm filming this. Like, a week or two after I finished it. So I can't even remember what I've said in, the, in this video. But if you haven't read this, go and read it because it's such a good book. Even if you think you're not going to like it, you probably will. Well, that's all it's going to be for this video. Please comment, like and subscribe and I'll see you in the next video. Oh,